Let's learn some magic. Hey, Ars Nouveau Flight. For the Ritual of Flight, you will need a Source Jar, you will need a Ritual Regier, and you will need a Tablet of Flight. The basic Tablet of Flight uses 2% of your Source Jar each time you activate it, meaning each full Source Jar gives you 50 instances of 1.5 minutes of flight. The recipe for a Tablet of Flight is one vexing archwood log, three wilden wings, two diamonds, and an ender pearl. If you have ours elemental installed, you can use one flashing archwood log, a wilden wing, a feather, and two diamonds, which is a little bit cheaper. The tablet of permanent flight uses your tablet of flight you've already made, two additional feathers, a glyph of knockback, a glyph of leap, and an air essence. The Glyph of Knockback uses three pistons and an air essence, while the Glyph of Leap uses three wilden wings and an air essence. And the air essences can all be made using an imbuement chamber with pedestals with a feather, a wilden wing, and an arrow. As you probably know, the items are not used up as you craft each air essence. I placed the imbuement chamber pretty far away from my scribe's table because the scribes table will take from those pedestals, just like they pull from any other inventory. You don't necessarily have to have them that far away, but maybe make your glyphs before you start imbuing your essences. When you activate Permaflight, it runs the ritual once and applies it to anyone who is in the immediate area. So if you have a team of people that you'd like to have Permaflight, make sure they're all with you when you do it. Permaflight uses 40% of a jar of source. Permaflight stays applied until you die. It can actually save you a lot of source to use permaflight rather than the regular tablet of flight. 